Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It is the new year. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded. I've been with family. I've been back in school. Like, it is all going great for your girl. I am coming back to you guys today with a hair tutorial kind of thing. How I got these, like, curls in my hair. You guys are going to see. I'm flashing the screen now to before and after. Before, it looked like a little crazy mess. But after, I finally got it to the way I wanted it to be. I'm super super excited for that so if you guys would like to know how I got these nice and like really bouncy now because my hair is really stiff at first and then I like dipped it and like you'll see all that in the video but how I got these like curl kind of things going on here just keep on watching and oh if you haven't subscribed go on and subscribe for your girl up there and that'll be great or it's down here depending on how you have your device thank you guys so much for watching and let's get into this tutorial Alright guys, so the first thing that you want to do is section off your hair and start braiding your hair down. So in this process, don't worry about trying to make everything look so pretty or whatever. You need to just part it in different sections and then start braiding it down. So after I'm done messing with my hair, I start by parting my hair into a small section and then I start braiding halfway down. I don't start all the way up there because my hair will be up there and I'm, when I dip my hair in the water later on in the process I don't want to actually get my real hair in steaming boiling water. So you'll see why that's all necessary later on. So this is me after all the sections are braided down very tightly and you'll know if they're tight because you will be able to scrunch them up like this and this is very key when you're about to dip your hair. So I'm just about to take this foam cup, put it in the microwave and get it hot as I can so that I can dip my hair because I don't want to use anything that we actually use for cooking in the kitchen. So this is a key. They gotta take a dump. They gotta take a dump. Okay, so what you see me doing right here is taking each section at this point and dipping it in the water and holding it in there for a few seconds. It doesn't have to be for long because, you remember, this is really hot water that we're dealing with. And excuse me for any weird camera angles. My little brother was recording this, as you heard in the beginning, because he had to go take a dump. But, yeah, all I'm doing here is dipping it and then I am wiping it off while well, holding it. And squeezing it with my towel to wring out the water. And you're just going to repeat this whole process for the rest of your head. So yes, you see me cutting the ends of my hair with this knife. No, I did not hurt myself in the process, but I could not find any scissors in my house. Every time it's time for me to do my hair, scissors are gone everywhere so you see me like I said cutting the ends and then you're going to be taking down the braid and you're going to repeat this step all over your head then fluff and style hi right, guys thank you so much for watching I really love my hair and you saw everything that I had did hopefully you liked it and this really looks like the freshman year Aisha picture of the hair so yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed it more videos on how i style this hair will be coming up soon like comment and subscribe and i love you guys bye